Hey guys, so I'm just going to the sites today just to check up on things, make sure we are happy with the progress and we certainly are. I'm just currently at the five bed um, HMO in our Article 4 area that we're converting. So we're putting five bathrooms in this one as well. So it's a relatively small house, but in a great area. The town centre is literally like three minutes walk. Um, you've got the train station the opposite way, which is about seven minute walk. And then you've got the university, which um, if you're walking is about 15 minutes cycling is like eight minutes or so so really excellent location so i can give you a quick show around <laughs> Um, so we've got this room here is a nice double room we've got the ensuite here the built-in wardrobe and then we're coming through here this is going to have the cylinder in for all of the new um, bathrooms and then we've got this wall still to come out and the ones through here as well and that is a nice big galley kitchen breakfast bar on this side other side of the wall is going to be um, the american french freezer tv on the wall at the end there and then we've got um, this is an ensuite for the smallest room upstairs. So they've got an off suite basically. All the other rooms have got the built in to their rooms as well. We're gonna have a doorway put into here, which is gonna be the entrance and exit for four bedrooms because this room here has its own doorway. So that's got, it's more like a flat um, because it's got its own individual entrance and stuff. Um, I'll take you upstairs. So this one we've done a loft conversion on as well, just to maximise the space. Good builders working hard, you see. So this one, ensuite in here, and then we've got the wardrobe access just there as well. But again, a nice double size room. That was a large room before, which we've made smaller because obviously putting the stairs in for the loft. This is the smallest room. So again, it's a nice double size room, wardrobe here. So we've brought the entrance out just to get the square footage that was required for the license. And then that bathroom is downstairs. And then we've got in here, again, this had a nice sort of fitty wardrobe in the size. So we've made that the ensuite. They've got their built-in wardrobe here. Bed will go over here. So again, a nice size double room. And then stairs are now in for the loft conversion. So really, really good use of space up here. So we're gonna have the wardrobe over in that corner, ensuite over there. We've just done um, a little flip round. Thanks, darling. So we've done a little flip round um, of the architect's plans. So the plans are really good and everything. We've just had a quick um, just adjustments here and there when we actually get on site because certain things and floor layouts don't necessarily work all the time with head height because we're putting on suites in and it's about obviously getting the showers in and things like that. So really excellent, excellent property. We already had the pre um, valuation done before we completed on the property. So this is one that we're doing for one of our amazing clients. Um, she's really excited, it's her first HMO. So this is gonna be a beautiful hotel finish. Um, this area rents really quickly. So we'll be marketing the rooms very soon because this one's not gonna be um, very long because it's really, really fast so far. We're only a few weeks in and obviously there's a lot, lot been done. All the building work is finished. So we're now, joinery's gone in. The electrics are gonna be doing their second fix soon, getting the plastering done. Um, so it's all go all the time so off to the next project now it's been a really busy and productive day so far um, but really excited to share more wins with you 